Welcome to Salina A&E. My name is David Hawksworth. I'm your host, and today I'm here with Susan Hawksworth, who's the director of the Smoky Hill Museum. Susan, welcome. Thank you. We're here to talk about the need for volunteers and parade entries for the Smoky Hill Museum Street Fair. That's right. Smoky Hill Museum Street Fair is just around the corner. It's kind of hard to believe. Yeah. Uh, but September 28th is the day of Street Fair, and being that the museum only has a staff of about 12 people, we need like 70 volunteers to help get this event going. Wow, that's quite a bit. That's now, quite a bit. What kind of duties do they have? There's everything from greeting at the entrance to the museum, greeting people coming in, to do a make and take crafts, helping with chili cook-off, uh, ticket sales, uh, to help if you have a lot of strength and don't mind getting up early, help set up the event and help take down the event later. Um, working with uh, kids on different activities. There's just a big variety of things. We also need some parade volunteers, so that's a, that's a shorter time period. Mm -hmm. um, don't need to work quite as long, but it's very concentrated, and we need parade volunteers for at some of the intersections to, to pull barricades and others to help get the lineup going and getting the parade off to a good start. Wow. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot of work for, <laughs> for a street fair day. Um, how long are the shifts? Shifts typically are three hours. Uh, like I say, the parade shifts are a little bit shorter. Mm -hmm. uh, chili cook-off sale, ticket sales is only like two and a half, but roughly three hours is about all we need. Okay. No experience needed, I take it? No experience needed. We can train you that morning of or the day of. The make, the make and take crafts are real simple little things. Basically, it's just kind of corralling the supplies and letting the kids do their thing. Um, and we're going to have some easier activities this year, so we shouldn't need anyone that knows how to rope oh, or do okay. archery. So uh, hopefully that will come to fruition and it'll be a fairly easy day for the volunteers. And interacting with the kids is always a hoot. Oh yeah, it's a great day to, if you love people, this is the time to come help with the museum because there are so many great people, so many different kinds of people that come to the event. Plus you get background music and if you come early or stay after your shift, you could uh, be able to taste some chili. All a good day. Yep. Okay, so if someone's interested in volunteering, how do they get a hold of you? Uh, they can call the museum directly, or you can go to smokyhillmuseum.org, click on Street Fair, and then there's another tab for volunteers. And what's the museum's phone number? 785-309-5776. And you're here 8 to 5, 8 Monday to 5, through Monday through Friday. Um, yeah, 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. Um, Rose is the one to talk to about volunteering, but anyone can uh, take your information and get back to you. Okay, well, sounds good. If you're interested in helping out with the street fair, this is a great opportunity to, to get involved and uh, learn a little bit more about the operations of the museum. That's right. So, now, we also are looking for parade entries for the parade, right? That's true. We need, in order to have a parade, we have to have entries. And right now we're sitting at about 29 entries and we'd really like to get that up to 50 or 60 or more. Um, no major fancy things uh, to do. You can be a walker, you can have a vehicle. If you want to do a float, that's awesome. Uh, we are doing an Old West theme on our parade. Uh, bicycle riders, uh, just about anything. Anybody can be in the parade. There is no fee for the parade. So you, it's free. You just need to go to smokyhillmuseum.org, click on street fair, click on parade. Okay, and the entry form is right there. And the entry form is right there, or you can call the museum again at 785-309-5776. What time does the parade start? The parade starts at 10, lineup starts at 9. Okay, and the parade route is what? Uh, from Elm to South, so on, on Santa Fe. Santa Fe, right. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so. Approximately a mile or so, I guess. About a mile or so, yeah. It's from basically from the Lee buildings down to the Masonic Temple. Okay. All right. Yeah, and usually the parade lasts oh, the 30 to 45 30 minutes. 30 to 45 minutes, yeah. So it's only about an hour, 45 minutes out of your day. If you have a group and want to get some information out about them, that's a great opportunity to do so. Yeah. 
Um, and the, uh, you have a theme this year, right? Our theme is Old West, just like in the past, but also fall theme. Um, so either one of those will work, but if you're a group of walkers and want to wear a t-shirt promoting your business, your group, uh, football, sporting group, not necessarily football, sports mm. group, uh, now's the time to, to do that. Or if you just want to show off your classic car or something That's like right. that. That's right. Classic cars are wonderful. Um, we've had just a little bit of everything. Yeah. Yeah. It's always been a great parade. It, uh, draws a lot of people and uh, you can you can see the throngs of people come down <laughs> come down to the the Iron Street. Street right to the museum yeah we usually have about 2,500 people here for the parade we actually go along and click hmm. so we know it's around 2,500 uh, per, uh, people viewing the parade so it's a great time to get word out about whatever it is you'd like to promote right okay well we're certainly hoping for great weather that day Oh, yeah, if, the day, if it could be like today, it'd be perfect. Yeah, yeah, just uh, sunny in, in the 70s or 80s. That's right. All right. Anything else we need to know about the, the, the parade Raid. and volunteering? Volunteering, uh, just go, be sure to call or go online. Uh, we welcome anybody uh, to be a volunteer or be in the parade. Okay. Well, sounds like an exciting day. Um, and you can be a part of it uh, just by calling the museum or getting on their website at smokyhillmuseum.org yes. and uh, check out all the volunteer opportunities that are out there and check out uh, mm -hmm. the parade entries too. So. That's right. All right. Susan, thanks very much. Appreciate your time. Thank you. And we'll see you next time on Salina A&E.